Uveal melanoma is the most common primary intraocular malignancy in adults. The incidence is highest in Caucasian populations. In Europe, the incidence shows a gradient from north to south, decreasing from over 8 to 9 per million in Scandinavia to less than 2 per million in the southern European countries. Despite successful control of the primary tumor, metastatic disease will ultimately develop in approximately 50% of the patients, with the liver being the most common site for metastasis. The median survival for patients with liver metastasis is about 6 to 12 months, and no treatment has in randomized trials ever been shown to prolong survival. One treatment option is isolated hepatic perfusion. The principal idea behind this technique is to surgically isolate a region of the body and then deliver a high concentration of a chemotherapeutic agent to the tumor while avoiding systemic toxicity. Briefly, the procedure starts with the placement of catheters into the femoral and external jugular veins. The catheters are then connected to an external venovenous bypass pump to allow for shunting of the blood when the caval vein is later clamped. For the perfusion, a catheter is placed into the caval vein under the liver and another catheter is placed into the proper hepatic artery. The arterial and caval catheters are then connected to a heart-lung machine and the perfusion is started. The liver is heated and the chemotherapeutic agent melphalan is then perfused through the liver for 60 minutes. The liver is rinsed and the procedure ends with...